Hey guys, I am Kyle. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make Reddit TikTok videos using AI. So let's get started. So here we are in uh, TikTok. And then as you can see, these are the contents that we would like to recreate, as you can see right here and so on right here. So this is a very popular niche and we're going to recreate it right here. So the first step that we will need is to search for the Reddit story right here. So uh, we can go here, search for Reddit story, and then you would have a bunch of search results. So in my case, I'll just go with this one. And then uh, from here, uh, most fascinating, fascinating Reddit stories right here. So I'm just going to go and maybe go for relationships. So I'm going to click on this one and then it would prompt me to the Reddit page. And then from here, I can just um, pick my story right here. So I'm just going to choose something uh, simple. So in my case, I'll just go for um, maybe this one right here, the second one right here. And then from here, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to take a screenshot of this. So I'm just going to go and snip this. I'm going to take my snipping tool right here, right here, which is right here. So I'm just going to snip this and right here, which is uh, this one right there. And bear in mind that you can also do this in uh, your mobile device. As you can see here, it would first um, show the title first that we have just copied, which is this one right here. And I think it's much better if you do it in mobile, but since this is ju just a tutorial, we'll just do it here in PC. And now from here in my snipping tool, I'm just going to save uh, this one right here. I'm going to save this, save as right there, and click on yes. And now that we have that, what we need is now we already have the script right here. And now once you have all of this ready, and now we can go into flixier.com and this would be the editing tool that we will use in creating this content. So from here, what we're gonna do is that we're gonna set the resolution first. So it should be vertical right here since it's in TikTok. And then from here, we are gonna find our stock footage, which is a Minecraft gaming video, just like this one right here. And I suggest that you find a lot of clips just like this one right here, because the clips here in Fixier that you can get in their stock right here is not really that good. So I have a few right here. So we'll be using this as an example since we are just making a short one just for the sake of tutorial. And from here, you want to navigate here on the right side. And from here, you want to click on fill canvas in order for the video right here to fill up the whole space right here in the screen. And then now that we have our background um, clip right here, what you want to do next is to import the, the snip right here. So I'm just going to go and find it right here. So it's right here. So I'm just going to go and drag this into here. And now it's uploading and there it is. So now we can click on this one right here. We can now import it right here. And then there you have it. We can now just um, make this bigger, just like that. Maybe something like that here in the center, just like that. Then there we have it. We now have that. And then uh, from here, the next thing is that we're just going to arrange this here. And now all that's left is the voiceover. So from here, what we're going to do is that we are going to click on our library and from here, click on import and rec or record right here. And now we're going to go click on text to speech. And this is where we will be typing our script. So from here, we are just going to go back into here and copy the title right here so that this would be included in the voiceover and paste that right here. And then from here, I'm just going to um, copy a little bit of the script right here since we are just doing this for for the tutorial just to keep it short right there just for an example and I'm going to go back here paste it here here and there it is as you can see you have reached the character limit so I'm just going to go and um, just delete some of this right here so just like that so now I'm going to choose the voice so in my case I'll just pick Daniel right here but of course you can feel free to explore other voices right here but in this example I'll just use Daniel and from here you want to click now on the voice settings if there is something that you would like to change and once you're done you want to click on generate so yeah, we can generate the voice right here, but we can't add it to library. So you need to unlock the text-to-speech feature here, which would require you to pay for that feature. So yeah, if you're willing to pay for that, then you would be able to unlock that feature. So now right here, I now have my voice over here in my timeline. As you can see right here, you can see the sound waves, which means these are my voice over.
So all this left basically is just to fill in the gap right here. So I'm just going to add more stock footages right here so that there won't be a black screen on uh, these parts. So I'm just going to cut it right here. I'm going to cut it and click here on cut and delete this. And then from here, I'm going to make this fill the canvas right there. And then I'm just going to expand this just like this one right here. So now that is all done, I think. But you also have the option to just go for the subtitles here. And you can go for auto subtitles so that you would have this kind of result. As you can see, these are subtitles right here. If you want that, then you can also do that. But we're just going with something simple here for this tutorial. So now I'm just going to export this right here and export and download right there. And now here is the result of that process. Did I cross a line with my married co worked and should I tell my husband? At the time we met, a lot of us were working a hybrid schedule and we were very understaffed. So yeah, that is basically the process on how you can make these types of videos. So that was a that was just a very short one because this is just an example on the process and how you can do it. But of course, if you're doing it for real, you should have even better Minecraft uh, stock videos on your background. And then you can also have the subtitles just like this one right here. As you can see, there is a subtitle right there. So that is basically it for this video. I hope this video helped you out. Thank you for watching.